Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is doing fantastic. I wanted to do a um, favorites video. Well, it's more like bags I don't ever want to sell. Now keep in mind, if there will come up an emergency, yes, I would sell. <laughs> I'd sell in a heartbeat if I had to. But these are bags in my mind I would never sell as of right now. Now I picked 15. I was going to do 10, but I have so many bags that that was almost impossible. But I can do another 15 if y'all would like to see another 15 more bags after this video. Just let me know. Put it in the comments down below. But um, this is the first 15 I have picked. And um, also, let me know what's your favorite out of these 15. Pick one or two or whatever you would like. I'd love to hear y'all's opinion. Okay, let's get going. And also, like I said, let me know if you'd like to see another 15. So here we go, my first one. These are no particular order. Um, and I might not know the names, y'all. A lot of the bags I have forgotten the names, so just bear with me, please. This is my Radley London. Absolutely love this bag. I love having the, sorry if you hear my dogs barking. They're playing. Um, I have the, the, love this pocket on the back. I have the handles and a shoulder strap there. And here's the inside. It is stuffed. There's a dust cover in there for the wallet. This is the wallet. This bag is so stinking cute. That it is so darn cute. I love this bag. Okay, that is one. Let's see if I can get all these lined up behind me. Let's see if I can do it here. This Radley London. Y'all seen this a good bit. This is one of my favorite bags right here. The most comfortable bag to use. It's in the neoprene um, material. You can wear this crossbody shoulder, handles. It just has so many uses. I love it. I've used this bag a lot. It's one of my most used bags. It's the medium crofter's way bag, I believe it's called. Beautiful. I love the pale pink. I love all the organization it has. This right here that's clipped in here actually goes to the Radley London I just showed y'all. But I was using it in this bag last. Isn't that pretty? Okay. Trying to get my bed to where the bag will stand up. I got a pillow right here, and that's where they're wanting to tilt over when I show y'all. Next is my Mark Jacobs small tote bag. I added that little shoe charm on. So cute. I love the denim. It's one of my favorite bags, also, to use. It's super comfortable. You just throw whatever you need in there. It has the pockets right there. I bought the pouch, goes with it. And here's the strap. That can be worn crossbody or over the shoulder, adjustable over the shoulder. Um, and this, when you zip it up, you can put this in there. Or use this little thing to hang your sunglasses on or whatever you'd like. But I love the patchwork. Okay. Next, we have my Dooney and Bird Camo Duck. This is the Olivia Satchel. This I've added on. And also, this is not the original strap. I have that strap on another bag. This strap, I love on this one, because it's wider. This one came with my suede drawstring bag. <laughs> so I took it off that one and put it on this one. I've had this bag for so many years. So cute. I love how the material is on this. I did have the tote and I had the drawstring in the duck camo, but I sold those and wanted to just keep one. And this is my favorite. Y'all know how much I love satchels. 
love the side pockets. They're nice and, you know, big where you can actually use them. Y'all yeah. know on some bags, the side pockets, they're not usable at all. Okay, let's see what we got here next. We have this Vera Bradley Glenna. This is in the Tropics, Tropics plaid, I think. Love the set so much. I love this print. It's one of my favorite prints. It's such a happy print. Such a comfortable bag. I love all the pockets. It even has a pocket over here that zips. Well, I can't zip it one handed, but. And look at the inside lining. I love that. I have the matching uh, cosmetic case. I have a the straps inside, but this is a crossbody. When I don't want to wear this, I can grab this out of my bag and throw my phone in it. Just some, you know, a few things I need. Put the strap on and use it as my little crossbody. I have a mask. I have a little ID coin case. And I have the turn lock wallet. Look how pretty that is, the purple. Love it. Okay. But I have a lot of um, Vera sets I've sold over the years and some I regret selling. I think we all do that. It comes a time when there are some bags we regretted selling. God knows I have. But, um, but that's what I like to do. I like to buy and sell, but I, you know, the ones that I love so much or are sentimental to me, I keep. And if I get tired of them or I just don't want to use them again or something like that, you know, plus I keep buying, so I can't keep them all. And a lot of people say, well, you're just going in a circle by buying and selling. But yes, that's a circle I love running in. <laughs> it's something I absolutely love to do. I'm obsessed with purses, so love getting new ones and then selling them when I don't want them anymore. This is a fry bag that I love. I cannot remember the name of this. I'll look inside, but it's like a camo too. It's a leather bag. I remember my mama got me this, but I love that pocket on the back. Kind of like doubled the strap through these hoops so it would um, fit shorter. But you have like here, this magnetic closure. It's like that raw leather on the inside. Um, you have a pocket here, fry label. You have a zip compartment here. And in the front you have two slip pockets there. Um, let's see, here it is. Charlie flap shoulder. I thought it had something to do with Charlie. <laughs> Those are the cards that come with it. The only thing that bothers me about this bag that I didn't care for, it's gonna be hard to see, but if you see down in here, the inside lining has a loop like here, like cut out in each compartment. I have no idea why that is because stuff can go behind there and get underneath the lining of the bag. So I have no idea why they made it like that. It's really weird. But what I do, I keep all my little things that can float around in my bag in here. Plus I always use pouches, so it's not too bad for me. But I just thought that was weird, the way that was made. But it's a gorgeous bag. Okay. Next, we have the Guest Camina bag. I love this bag. It was so hard finding it. This also came in a tote. I did add this charm on, but it came with this one, which is really cute, 1981. Um, I love the color of this, like, brushed gold hardware. You have two zip pockets up here. That's the back. It's soft, soft quilted. Oh, it's so soft. Inside is super nice. You have the chain strap. And here is the zip around wallet. It's the Kamina, I guess Kamina. 
But this bag is beautiful. It has pockets on the inside also. Sorry if you hear my air cutting on and off. It is on right now. I mean, not on right the second, just cut off, but that's what you're hearing in the background. Okay. My next is my Michael Kors tote. Y'all seen this a million times over the years. This is my most used bag. Most used tote. It has been through the ringer. <laughs> This is like one of them totes that you don't have to care about. It don't matter what the weather is. It doesn't matter what you're doing, where you're going. You can grab this and go. Um, it has this wristlet, wallet type thing with it. You have a pocket there and here and a large pocket there. And on this wall, there's another little it goes with it have two pockets here but this bag is just so comfortable I love the large back slip pocket where my phone fits perfect in there the straps are a perfect drop length they're comfortable they're not too wide or too thin all of this material the canvas it's just nice it's just I just can't believe how much I have used this bag and never would have dreamed I'd use it as much as I have over the years when I bought it. It's so nice. I believe this came from the Michael Kors outlet years ago. I think it was like, like one of my maybe second, third, fourth videos I'd ever done. Okay, next is my Kate Spade. I love this bag. I love how clear it is. It's crystal clear. I love the little uh, tab there. And where you hook the um, hook onto. It's very unique. You can use it by the handles. You can take off the strap. But the strap is beautiful. And it is so comfortable. It also comes with a pouch. And I have some accessories in there that I put with the bag. My Kate Spade wallet and my card case. And that is the name. Sam see-through but isn't that pretty y'all there's the bottom you got a bottom and you have feet but I love this bag now another one I don't ever want to sell is this and this is a hard bag to find is this Calvin Klein my mom bought me this years ago on Christmas well at Christmas time and um I fell in love, in love with it when I saw it, and she told me to grab it. That was going to be my Christmas present. And the reason why I love this bag so much, because this bag, like, fits to my body just perfect. It has this little slope there. You know, you can see at the top of the bag, the, the straps fit perfect over my shoulder. It's just, you know how you find a bag here and there that just fits you perfect, and this one does me. It has a side zip pockets there. I don't, yeah, it has one on each side. I couldn't remember. There's the bottom. I do not know the name of this bag. I don't have the tag anymore. But I love it so much. It does have pockets on the inside. It's stuffed, y'all. So it's kind of hard to pull that out. But it's a beautiful, beautiful shoulder bag. And it's, I've used this one quite a bit also. Now... Another one that I absolutely adore is my Coach Rogue and the little pink elephants. Is that not cute or what? Oh my goodness. When I saw this bag, I just went crazy. For one thing, I love elephants. I love the color pink and I love the Rogue and I wanted a Rogue so bad. And I like the new ones because the handles flapped down and didn't, you know, kind of stay that way. I love the chunky coach tag, the suede on the inside, just a little card pocket there, you have a nice pocket there, it comes with a crossbody strap, and I have the matching wallet, isn't it cute? I added a little coach charm bear on there, but it's so cute, let me see if I can open. Yeah, I've never used the strap. 
but because these straps right here, I don't wear too many crossbodies unless they're really little, but um, this strap here, these shoulder straps work perfect for me. I love the drop on them, so I have no need to use the strap, but the bag is absolutely gorgeous. Okay, my next one, I'll tell you what, let's go ahead and do this one. This one is my Dooney and Burke Multicolor. Um, this is the Brianna, I think. Oh, I hope I got that right. Here we go. Bag is beautiful. Love this bag. I might be pulling this one out soon to use it. I love these compartments here. I love how strong the snaps are on this bag. I have the matching little... Um, kiss lock coin case and I have the matching wallet here but this bag is fun I love this drop length of the strap on it and that's the bottom but isn't it beautiful I love how shiny it is oh it's so pretty Okay, oh, here we got three more left, and y'all, all three are Nishkas. I love my Nishka bags. This is the fairy tale one y'all seen over the years. I've had this one for so many years. It's a beautiful, beautiful bag. have pockets on the end you have a nice slip pocket back there a zip pocket in the back it's one thing I love about Anishka is all the organization their bags have when they're hand painted you have a wall zip pocket there and a slip there here is the little clip-in which you can remove a little wallet love the purple lining two pockets there the strap for that. And I also have some little pouches somewhere. I think they're in my accessory drawer that goes with this. They're the color. They're, they look like that. Okay. My next Anishka is my Cleopatra's Leopard, I think it's called. I love this bag. It has a strap with it too. Here is the charm. This is the back. You have a pocket here. You have a zip there. There's the bottom. Let's see here. Again, I should unzip these before the video. Here is the inside. Nice walls at pocket there. My air is cutting back on. I apologize. You have the strap here. You have a zip compartment there. I have the little coin case here. I like the little French wallet. And I have the little card case here. And you have pockets here and here. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, I love this bag. I love Anishka bags. I really do. I mean, there's a few more I want. Hopefully I can get them sometime this year. That's that. And the last... It's a Nishka is my panda bag. Oh, I think this is so, so cute. Isn't that adorable? I love panda bears. So when I saw this, oh my goodness. <laughs> you have a large zip pocket there. Your phone pocket here. You have some handles here. open. Okay, we have a turn lock 
wallet. This one's by Anna. Anna Nishka. Or it's an Anishka makes it or something like that. I don't remember how that goes. But here's a little pouch. That was it. Y'all, I do not remember I'm trying to feel for it. See, it has a key clip. I don't remember if this had a strap with it. I'm not feeling one in here. Because usually I'll keep it with the bag, but it might be in a drawer. Because I do have some straps. And, well, it's, they're actually in a huge tote. A bunch of extra straps. And I do believe this came with one. Yeah, it's not in here. But it's the color of this. Yeah, I remember it now. It did. Pretty sure. <laughs> okay, y'all. That is my 15. I think that was 15. Got a hope. <laughs> Bags that I do not ever want to sell. I could do 15 more if y'all would like to see that video. Because majority of the bags I have left, I have some more I do want to kind of, you know, I'm probably going to sell. But um, it's the ones I do want to keep that. Like all these, I really love all these bags. So, um, if you have any questions or comments, please put them down below. And I appreciate all y'all's kind of comments. I enjoy reading them. I try to get back to them, you know, as soon as I can. So, please be patient with me on that. But I do read all you, all of your comments, and I appreciate them so much. But like I said, if you could leave a comment down below and tell me which one or two bags is your favorite out of the selection. And also, if you'd like to see another 15 of my bags that I do not want to sell. 10 or 15, whichever y'all would like. And um, also, take care. Hugs to you all. And hope to see you on my next. Bye-bye.